I'm all for Christmas. All the happy smiles and the wishes. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another cozy vlog. So, oh, sorry, just pumping my seat up. Obviously, I'm parked. <laughs> I'm not driving with no hands and on my phone. Um, I thought in today's video we could have a full on Christmassy festive day together and I'm really looking forward to it and that means one thing that means driving to TK Maxx looking at all the new in stuff hopefully buying Christmas candles I want to get some presents for Bradley's mum and I think I want to get something for my mum as well but Bradley's mum is actually hosting my baby shower and I know she's putting so much like love and effort into it which is just the sweetest thing so I just wanted to get her a couple of things basically just to say thank you and like I appreciate it and then afterwards I'm also going to get my nails done for my baby shower this weekend and so I'm really looking forward to it so if you guys are as well please give this video a thumbs up so I'm just just putting my phone in the right place if you're looking forward to today's video please do give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're new and let's have a cozy weekend together and I'm really looking forward to it so yeah Christmas all the happy smiles and the wishes and I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe you're missing I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow whatever we do we will be all right these holiday wonders will open your mind may all your wishes tonight come true the love I live the dream I knew this Christmas I only want Close to you. time full of kisses take a walk outside and tickle the snowman's nose moving nimbly did you hear something from the chimney i will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow I have been to TK Maxx, looked at the time and thought, oh my God, <laughs> I need to leave. Um, so I've just parked up and I'm gonna go and get my nails done now. Close your eyes. Get some rest. I'm by your side. I know you've had a really bad day But I'm right here, it's gonna be okay The world could fall down, it's gonna be okay Go 
I've just got home and um, these are my nails so I went for a chromey French tip and I'm so obsessed with them I wanted like a thick tip this time and I really like it but it does make my nails look so much longer than they are <laughs> it's like a hat so I'm really happy with them I think these are really good for like a baby shower and um, but also like when I film my decorate for Christmas and stuff like that they're just perfect because they're neutral but really shiny and sparkly. I love them. I'll pop my sister's salon in the description box down below because if you're from Brighton or you're like visiting Brighton or whatever, go to her salon <laughs> to get your nails done because they're honestly the best and you, you just can't beat it. It's the best thing. I didn't realise though, when you have a C-section, you can't have your nails done. So, can't have my nails done when the babies are here. And I always thought I'd have like really nice, obviously short, but like neutral kind of nails and I can't even get them done. <laughs> so I have to wait until after, but yeah. So I'm just going to enjoy the long nails until the next, you know, month or two. Then it'll be short for I don't know how long, <laughs> just because it's more practical, isn't it? I, I mean, I'll probably still do pointy, but like short, if that makes sense. Anyway... I've developed a new symptom literally since I was at her salon. It's just come. <laughs> I love how each video I'm like, okay guys, new symptom. <laughs> I'm not used to all these symptoms. It's heartburn. <laughs> I've got heartburn. It's so funny because for so long I've been like, oh my God, I haven't had any heartburn. And I think it means if you have heartburn, your baby's born with a lot of hair. I don't know if this is like an old wives tale, but apparently it's true. So I don't know. And I haven't had any heartburn at all. And then today it's like someone's just switched it on and I'm like, mm, <laughs> this is not nice. So Bradley said he's got to pick some things up from the shop on his way home anyway. So he's going to grab me some Gaviscon because I need it. But online it said to drink some milk um, and it's actually helping, which I'm really surprised about because... I've been drinking loads of water and stuff and nothing's like worked, but this is actually helping. So this is helping me right now. So I thought I could show you guys what I got from TK Maxx. I've also had a couple of other deliveries that I thought I could show you guys as well, which I'm really looking forward to because it's stuff for the twins room, which I've spoken about in my previous video, like lights and things. So very exciting. Okay, TK Maxx, I picked up this hamper. They had so many, this color, white and then like a more of like an albany kind of brown three pounds 99 and this is a hamper basket so you get all the stuff inside you get a giant bow and then is it the cellophane cellophane that kind of wraps around it um to make it look like a really cute hamper so this is for bradley's mum just to say thank you and then i also picked her up because i've been collecting things for her so i have got stuff upstairs but i saw this set and i thought this packaging and the products couldn't be more her there's a candle in there bubble bath shower cream and moisturizer and she likes to relax and have a bath so i thought this is um a perfect set for her so that is going to go in her hamper i picked up these really cute little festive spatulas which were 3.99 love these love the print of them gonna do baking of course so i thought I need bits and bobs like that to help. Um, I picked up this really cute peppermint and snow vanilla. Um, and this is a hand wash and hand and body lotion. So I don't know where I'm going to put this. I don't know whether to put it in the kitchen, which I think I might to be fair. Because in the bathrooms I have the same soap. <laughs> and I'd feel bad just picking one bathroom. So I think I'll probably put this in the kitchen. Um, but I like how it has a metal tray that is in already. So yeah, to be fair, I think it'll look nice in our kitchen. So yeah, and it's quite big. And I thought this is perfect for like the decorate me. I had to get a candle. <laughs> um, they didn't have many and I was trying to film as much as I could, but it was really like quiet. And I felt like all the staff were looking at me <laughs> when I was in there. And I was like, uh, I was getting a bit embarrassed because I didn't want them to be like, what are you doing? <laughs> Can you not? So I was a bit like, um. um but yeah, the, cr the candles weren't that good. I don't know if it's like a transitional kind of season where it's like they're trying to get rid of like the autumn Halloween-y things. And then they're slowly putting out all the Christmas stuff. 
but this candle one i love the look of it it's like a stone with christmas trees on and two it smells incredible it is white pine um i don't know what the brand is m of wg is that what it, the brand is i don't know it was 8.99 honestly this smells like a pine tree with a hint of christmas goodness <laughs> it just smells so good and they had quite a lot of these so i have a feeling i feel like every time there's like a lot of a candle they do it in loads of different tk maxes so smell this if you see it because it smells so lovely it's literally christmas in a candle and that's white pine so good so i picked up that um i picked up this cozy scarf because this print is so me <laughs> and it is the softest scarf ever if you're looking for like the perfect scarf that's affordable and it's not itchy always check tk maxx because they always have the best it was 16.99 i think which is so good so soft and just so comfortable and i can imagine me wearing this wrapping the twins around me it's like a blanket so soft and so snuggly so i'm really excited about that i'm gonna try and do as much baking as i can in november <laughs> it's so good because i've never been pregnant before i don't know like what it's gonna be like right near the end so i want to be as festive as i can at the minute um, and just try and get loads of festive things in so i picked up these cupcake cases they were 4.99 and there's 75 in here i mean i don't think i'm gonna make 75 cupcakes but you can see how cute they are and the print of them is just adorable this one is my favorite i just love them i mean i love all of them in their own different way they're just so cute just to see um and then the next things i got was this i love it it's like a really skinny christmas tree but you can kind of like shape it into the perfect kind of shape that you want it this was only 7.99 um, and I thought this is perfect to put either on the island, cute Christmas tree on the island, on the dining table or on our, what's it called? <laughs> Windowsill. <laughs> I was thinking, what is it called? I'm going to do a really cute little village on the windowsill in the front room and I thought it'd be really cute. I could put this on it as well. So I might do, I'm going to kind of see how it is, but I really like it it's just really simple and it's really cute and thin <laughs> it's like a skinny christmas tree but i really like it and i think yeah it's just really cute and christmasy and i love it i picked up this mug how cute is this 4.99 i literally i love it so much and it's so big i like the stone bit here and the christmas tree it's just so cozy and like massive this is a really good hot chocolate mug <laughs> so i picked up that i should have got two really and then lastly i picked up this so this is for the village as well um you pop a little tea light in the back and then obviously it lights up 7.99 but look how cute it is like the print up close you've got the reindeers you've got a little christmas tree it's just adorable I love it and I love how the doors open a little bit but yeah we're gonna do a really cute village on the windowsill this year and I can't wait for it it's just gonna look so cute and I'm excited to put like tea lights and stuff in just to make it extra cozy and make the house smell all lovely and festive so that was everything I got from TK Mac I'm so happy these came because I ordered these ages ago and I was like um are these gonna come or not and um, these are perfect these are to go on the cots in the twins nursery um and you just basically it's just handy obviously again just by myself they're not going to sleep in there anytime soon but when they eventually do it's good to put like dummies in here or hold a bottle while i'm like sorting them out it's just good to have it on the actual cot um and you can have little things in here for display like little teddy bears or something it's just gonna look really cute and i really like i've gone for plain white it's plain white and then the rope is like beige it was so affordable from ebay it did take a little bit to come i'd say maybe a week i think i'm just used to amazon <laughs> where it comes next day so i think it took a week to come but obviously it's so worth it because it was a lot cheaper than amazon so i'll pop a link to them down below and then <laughs> Some things from Amazon. I picked up a pregnancy support belt. I'm hoping that this actually helps 
to be fair i don't need this i i thought because i thought because i'm pregnant with twins i'm gonna need this so soon and it's gonna be something that i'm literally like oh my god for my second trimester i need it but it's actually been so fine i think obviously they kind of grow with you so you get used to like the weight but sometimes when they're on a nerve it really hurts to walk like especially like my lower back so yeah i got this it's not recommended to wear this for a long period of time by the way but sometimes you just need that extra bit of help sometimes bradley will come behind me and like lift my belly up a bit and it's like it's like a release isn't it it's so nice so for the twins room i asked you guys in my previous video what should i do for lights because as you walk into the left I didn't know what to do in that section because it's really dark in their room. They've got such a big room, but the window's so small. That's one thing I don't really get about this house. I love it so much, but the windows are just so small <laughs> to the point where you're a bit like, come on, you could have so, like, it could have been a bigger window, but anyway. So I wanna add more light into there and majority of you said fairy lights around the mirror and I think that is just gonna look so cute. So I picked up some. Obviously I got plug-in ones because battery fairy lights, I feel like are good for like Christmas time because by the end of Christmas, the batteries kind of go, but not for like every day. And a lot of you said babies love fairy lights and sparkly things and things like that. So I think that'll look perfect. So I saw this hack on TikTok. I'm gonna show you because this girl needs credit okay it's such a good idea that i was like oh my god i was so influenced i bought it straight away okay watch this so she like puts it on her mirror and i was like oh my god that is such a good idea because for so long i've been like what do i do in my beauty room because again the window's really small and the seasons, you know, it's getting dark really early and it's dark in the mornings as well. So I'm like, I need help getting ready. I bought these little lights from um, Ikea, but they're just not practical <laughs> whatsoever. So I bought it. You basically stick it around what you want. So it's so seamless and then you just turn it on. Like, how good is that? So it's got a control and then obviously it's plug in as well. It didn't want battery. Um, so I wanna put this around my mirror in my beauty room. So yeah, again, we can do that in this vlog because I'm really excited about that. Um, and then the last thing I got, I don't actually remember. <laughs> do you ever just have like a little spree of <laughs> ordinary stuff on Amazon? I don't know how long I haven't been in focus for. That's really annoying, sorry about that. But do you ever have like a spree of like ordering bits on Amazon and then <laughs> you wake up the next day and you're like, oh my God, I don't remember ordering this because <laughs> I do it all the time. Anyway, oh, I do remember this. I do remember. So this is to go in the twins room and this is little jars. I got three because I've got ones like this, but they're so tall. I don't have any this size um, and I want to put cotton balls in here dummies in some of them it comes in a packet of three um and i thought these and these will look really lovely on display so that's what i'm gonna do put those ones on display and they will be in my organized nursery video so yeah that is coming very soon but yeah that was everything i picked up let me know what your favorite thing was in the comments down below i'm gonna finish my glass of milk because it's helping and i'm gonna sit on the sofa and edit my next video which would have gone live yesterday actually so if you haven't seen that make sure you do um so yeah i'll check in with you guys in a bit this afternoon i've just been doing loads of work um i've been filming some like ad bits <laughs> for amazon and stuff like that guys i've been working with amazon for christmas and we just kind of decorated little bits for christmas downstairs and it's just so exciting um, i'm not going to show you yet i'm going to put the reel and stuff up first but yeah it's so exciting and i can't believe next week me and ready are decorating for christmas it's just crazy like properly um so i've just popped on leggings a vest top and this 
cozy kind of like cape thing and me and Bradley are about to go into town I'm gonna film like new in Primark and H&M which I'm gonna have I think in my next vlog so I'm gonna incorporate it in that but I just wanted to show you guys because you know when I was unboxing all the Amazon stuff I said to you that I got the lights for my beauty room and oh my god it's made the biggest difference so I'm gonna show you look at the difference on and off this is insane I was gonna put them around it but I mean ignore how messy it looks <laughs> but I've just kind of stuck it here because when they're off they're bright yellow and I just thought no I don't want them on the edge so I put them all around this this and this kind of like intertwine them over I can't get over the difference so for example say I'm sitting here do my makeup with you guys. I just press on. I can't get over the difference. And I like how I've put it behind because it kind of gives everything like a softer light. Um, and you can turn the brightness down. Although you get lines on the screen when you do that. Um, there's like a timer or you just turn it off. This is literally what I've been looking for for so long because I've always had my Hollywood mirror but I just, we sold it when we moved house, but I just like the look of this mirror because it's really simple, but effective. And I like how it's got like the sides and things like that. I just think it looks really nice on your dressing table. Um, so yeah, this made such a big difference. So I'll pop a link to this down below. I think it was three meters long, but you can kind of like go back on yourself. And yeah, it's made a really big difference and I'm so happy about it. So I thought I would share it with you guys because I said I would do it with you, but I can't go over the difference. Like when I turn it off now, <laughs> it's just, it's so much better. So yeah, I'm so happy. I finally found something that's gonna help me, um, especially in the colder months because it's such a pain trying to do this and like get ready and things like that in the lighting in here it's awful so i found a way me and Bradley are going to go into town now like i said the new in will be in my next video where we go to primark and h&m and stuff um, and then we're going to come home for a chilled evening which is very needed because it's my baby shower tomorrow which i can't wait for so yeah but i have got a lot of work to do tonight so <laughs> i think we're going to pick up some dinner on the way home Smiling at me as so many times before. 